Why, hello, fellow YouTubers. I am David Hooper from channel How to Draw Awesome Stuff. And for my first drawing tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to draw Master Chief. Master Chief is probably one of the awesome characters in video game history. And I'm going to be showing you how to draw him right here, right now. So, get your pencils ready, and let's draw some Chief. Okay, first of all, we're going to make a basic sketch of his body. Now, I'm going to be using Google Images for this. So, it, it's not technically, you know, copying off, but... Okay, so... We're going to start right here. Move my page down here so you guys can see. First, we're going to... We're not going to be, uh, pay much focus to this, but we're going to make the little base where his body is going to be, or, you know, where his, uh, his uh, legs or, you know. Okay, so we're going to make a basic sketch here. Well, that will be his arm, just draw a circle. And then follow that with some lines, kind of like a little cylinder or something, or a 3D cylinder. Okay, then you are going to make his hand. Just make it a, just a basic shape for now, and we're going to go back in, and we're going to uh, fix some loose ends up, and we'll do that. So just leave it like that for now. Okay. Then you're gonna follow it up right here. Now we're going to get in his chest area. Okay. Move it down a little. We're not going to make the head just yet, but the now. Just make a just make a little circle so it can give you a little indicator that that's where the head's going to be. Just make a little circle. We're going to go back. Uh, like I said again, we're going to go back in and we're going to fix it up right there. So don't think it's going to be in the actual head, guys. Just follow with me, you know, and uh, you'll see why he had to follow these steps. So, we're going to draw the rifle, or just a basic little sketch of the rifle, right here. Now just make that little rifle right there. Now, there's a straight line down the page. Nice this line, sorry. Common little mistake. Okay. We'll go back and add some <laughs> I'm sorry I keep saying that, it's just I don't want you guys to think that I'm not a good artist, you know. But guys, this is necessary. It really is. Trust me on this. So, we're just going to make a real basic sketch of his rifle. Say that again. Be <laughs> repeating myself. Oh, I gotta stop that. So, just then you're just going to make a little like, kind of like uh, a little bump right here. Uh, it's just then we're going to make a. Uh, little tube or the muzzle right here. Okay. Right there. Now that's just gonna be the basic sketch of the rifle that you're gonna make come down right here in this section of it. And you're going to make the second hand. Okay.
right here, it's going to be connecting to this section of the rifle, right here, to the battle rifle, and we're going to, this is some of this armor plating of the chief, and we're going to curve that up to his shoulder right here, and then, or to his neck, that would be a good way to put it. Now you will make his left shoulder pad right here. So just make like a kind of like a shield, you know? Just like make a normal little shield. That's uh, pretty much what it is. Now if you're wondering this is the basic this this is the design of the Halo 4 version of the Master Chief's armor. So uh yeah. You probably don't know what I'm talking about if you haven't played the games, but, uh, you know, check them out, or just at least see videos about it. Okay, so, okay guys, now we're going to make his arm right here, just make a little simple Let's make a little simple arm right here. We're, not, we're gonna go back, like I said. Oh crap! This gonna be him me saying that a lot. Okay, and then right there, make his arm. Okay, guys, that will be our sketch. Hold on. This. Uh, sorry, I forgot this little plane right here. Okay, guys, that's pretty much it for the basic sketch of things. Now we're going to go back, we're going to touch up in some detail. Okay, we're going to start off with his hands. So, right here, you want to fix up the left pad right here. Round it out. And it's going to be a little three-dimensional right here. Make these three little lines. Do not make them thin. You have to just they're just thin fat little lines right there. And then We're going to make the fingers right here. Now, you can draw little circles if it helps out. You know, guys, you can do that. It's uh, perf perfectly up to you if you want to do that. Okay, so. And this uh, drawing to might be cut into parts. Because I do not want to uh, make this a huge, you know, little video. So we're gonna make fingers. It's kinda like a robot, you know, if you picture a robot. Now, you're gonna want to keep them close together. See, so, yeah, you're gonna be seeing me in a race a lot, because, you know, nobody's perfect. Now, just make his little fingers. Don't make them too big. They're not big sausage fingers, you know. <laughs> that was my dark Cory that just ran in here and just sniffed my plague. Uh, here he comes again. Okay, so. That's the... Okay. 
think that looks good, guys, because uh, it doesn't we're going to just, uh, add some more detail in there. So clean up his hand a little bit, we're going to clean up the rough lines here. Good. So coloring that black right here. Now you want to dark. Uh, now for the fingers, you want to dark. You want to outline the armor pieces of his hand in dark and color in the rest of the like the leather kind of uh, material in just a little. Uh, lighter black. You don't want them to. You want them kind of to blend into each other a little bit, you know. Okay, so. his arm, but first you want to go ahead and color the rest of this, of the leather, leather, sorry, <laughs> uh, the leather. Okay, so, we're going to go into his arm. We're going to make like a little arc right here. Sorry. Let's go back to the arm. <laughs> Let's go back to the hand. And we're gonna we're just gonna color back in there, okay. So back to the arm here, you're going to want to arc this. Just make a little arc right there. And then you're going to make another, kind of like a little arc right here, and then make that touch the hand or glove right here. Okay, so we're making the rest of the armor piece for his uh, left arm. You want this to look like it'll, you know, like fit around his glove. Okay, we got the rest of his arm right here. You might uh, seem to go back and forth, and I'm sorry. Uh, if Phil, th uh, Feel uh, free to go back, like go back to a minute or two, and uh, catch up, or just uh, if you didn't add something there, you know, if or if you missed something, just uh, go ahead and just quickly add it in. Okay, so or go ahead and call, uh, shade that in. Okay, so we're going to make the details on his little arm right here. So we're going to make this little black bar right there. Now, don't forget, in this right here, you want to make sure that 
it's just to keep it a little bit popping out, you know, and uh, erase the uh, rough lines and these little sketch circles that you made earlier. Pull in that black bar, okay. sharpen it up a bit. Round out this section right here. Okay. So now I'm going to do a little 2D right here. Okay, I think that looks that looks good so far, guys. Let's just uh, keep going. Now, right here, you might want to like, I can't really explain this, you know, I, I uh, can't name word for word what the, what the armor is, but just, uh, just, uh, do what exactly I do, you know, uh, the sh uh, notice the shapes, you know, different kinds of shapes that I use, you know, I just, uh, notice different kinds of uh, shapes that the armor is made out of, you know. You know, I wish... I'm a big Halo fan, but I do not know, like, every single piece of armor uh, name is, you know. It's like... I don't know that kind of stuff. Okay, so that looks uh, good so far, guys. Now, if there's this technique that uh, will add some color, a, a little color, if you don't want to, you know, call uh, use crayons or colored pencils, you can take your thumb or any kind of finger right here. I use this uh, little finger and uh, rub it, like rub. I hope you can see that. It kind of adds that little rough effect to it, kind of, and I think it works great. You guys can use whatever you want, but I think that looks really good. Adds a little bit more detail to it. So if you want to add more like little squares or lines, you know, you can, because really there's all different kinds of little parts in Chief's armor, and you don't really have to get every single one right because, you know, <laughs> It's uh, kind of difficult to make all the pieces. Okay, so that's going to be his arm. His left arm. Okay, so. For his rifle. We're going to start on his rifle, and then we're going to come down here, and then we'll start with the right hand and arm. And then we'll tackle the chest area right here, and it'll uh, look good. So I'm just uh, darkening, maybe. You'll see me go back and darken some areas, because I do make mistakes, and there's some final touches that I just want to touch up here and there. So you'll see me do that. And I repeat a lot. I'm sorry. Uh, Okay, so, we're going to make his rifle. Now, it's mostly black and gray, so, expect to, to uh, use a lot of lead right here. We're going to darken the bottom line right here, okay, and then just go ahead and darken it. Just darken, just uh, shade it in right there. It's mostly just black. It's mostly just the color black. That's pretty much it. Try not to, uh, you know, uh, go over the fingers right here because you don't want to do that. 
Okay. Now, race. Now, right here, to his hand, this is going to be the trigger. Go ahead and make a, like, a little, uh, race that little path right there. And then you're going to make the trigger right there, or a little, uh, it, most, it just looks like a little, uh, square going into his hand. That's pretty much what it is. So, we're going to make the details of the rifle, we're going to start right here. Can't, I guess this may be, uh, we're going to go to the butt, I guess this is going to connect to the butt of the rifle. Follow and uh, draw the exact same details I do. Okay, exactly what I do. Not well, not exactly, you know. But try your best to do to get it accurate, because you know it, it's it's uh, it doesn't hurt to be a little bit accurate and a little bit neat. So, uh, what do you think about uh, the Master Chief games? I mean, uh, the Halo games, sorry. I think they're pretty good. They're really good games. I mean, I don't think there's a single bad, like, Halo game, you know? And people might say, well, Halo or ODST is not that fun. Well, I think it's really fun. I like it campaign, and it's probably one of the best so far, in my opinion. Uh, you probably see the same, too. You know? Uh, it's not just me. It's other people do. And, uh, people might be complaining probably, uh, about Halo Wars. Well, Halo Wars is actually, well, it's a Halo game. But, uh, it doesn't take the first person, uh, you know, first person traits like it did its older, you know, like it's the, their other games. So, okay. And uh, sometimes you'll see me uh, at my own spin. And uh, you know, uh, uh, while I'm you know making details and all this, and uh, there's really no uh, place for me to discuss anything, I'll uh, chat with you guys, like I just did right just uh, just now a few minutes ago. Just follow the simple little details. They're not much, and you can go. You can go back. You can, uh, you know, study a little bit and see what I did. You know, and you know what, guys? If I didn't do too well, explain it. I'm sorry. Pause the video and you know, try to try to uh, you know look at the shapes and look what I did right there. The little details. This is my first drawing tutorial, and I hope it's very helpful for you. Um, if it's not, I'm sorry. I really am. Okay, so. We're going to... Over here. Just leave this hand alone. Actually, make that... Give, just give it a little bit of a Now, in the future, I'm going to make a little simple, a little bit more simple drawing as well as for you guys if this didn't work.
we'll go back and add some more details to the front of the rifle. Okay, looks so good, guys. Looks uh, so good. So we're gonna make the little details. You don't, you know, you can go ahead and just make it black, but. Uh, it might not look that detailed, so you might want to just go ahead and make some little lines and maybe some little squares or triangles, just little ones, you know, because, you know, if you see, like, a rifle, you'll see it's, like, you know, it's, uh, like, you know, switches and all that detail in it. You probably don't know what I'm talking about, but if you look in the rifle, study, uh, like, a regular assault rifle, you know. Uh, like look at its at its shape and its uh, you know its details like you know uh, I don't know <laughs> I'm sorry okay so we're just making little details just ignore just ignore the hand. The hand means nothing now. I'm just kidding. We're gonna go back to it and finish it up. So, this is getting pretty long, guys. Um, so I'm probably will just put it in part two. You know. Just make little lines. You know, you don't have to go town with the detail, but. You want it to look good, so they don't uh, mess around. Okay, now go ahead and just make that so shade black. Darken in my lines and the shapes that I made right there. So, yeah, guys, I'm trying not to keep this too, I'm not trying to, you know, be awkward and try to keep this, uh, quiet as possible, but, uh, yeah. Just gonna, just make, just, I'm just gonna make the, uh, gray part of this rifle just a little bit bigger. Or just a little bit uh, sharper, you know. Okay, so we're going to do the same technique again, or it's optional, it's completely optional. So I'm just going to take my thumb again, and I'm going to, like, smudge, smudge it so, I, you know, you don't have to go back in and, like, do all that stuff, you know, uh, have to shade it in, and, you know, you know it, it saves light, it saves light. So I'm going to take my thumb or my finger right here. Pretty 
probably see this technique before on the internet. Spiffing it up a little bit. Now the barrel right here, we're gonna add some bit uh, detailing it as well. So just follow the same details I did, right here just make two little black lines and right here just like a little round similar, uh, just a little thin thing, just... I can't explain these pieces, I'm really sorry, I just can't, you know, but it's a barrel, you know, nothing much to it. And right here, on this little section right here, we're gonna go ahead and shade it, it's not too dark, just uh, a little bit darker than the others. Now, if you want to add some, maybe some shine, it, shine to your little rifle, you can like you know add some maybe shine as well. This race, you can it's completely optional. So it, there's like sh uh, a little shine to it. Fix it up my lines because they're not too straight. Okay. Okay, so the more back right here. make some, just uh, do the same thing, just make little simple lines. Okay. Just follow what I do. So, how was your day today? I, uh, got off uh, school just a few hours ago. You know, uh, I go to, uh, yeah, I can never tell what school I go to. Sorry. I just, uh, I want to keep my information to myself, so none of the creepers out there try to track me down. I'm watching you guys. <laughs> uh, you're actually watching me. Oh, crap. Okay. Yeah. Wow, this is already going over 30 minutes. <laughs> Crap. Well, like I said, guys, I'm gonna have to put this in separate parts. So, see me up my fear a lot right here. Try to capture the blackness. Wow, that rifle look, really looks good. A lot of detail into it. Mostly, uh, the uh, body of the rifle is just like little lines, little, uh, little triangles, you know. Not much, much to it, but you know, it, 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 it's pretty good detail, I'd say. It really good, it really looks good if you rub it, but you know, it's totally up to you guys. I'm not gonna force it down your throat, so. This, uh, yeah. And there's some parts you want to darken in. Like this uh, part right here. This little part of the rifle, little section. Okay, so we're almost done with this rifle. Looking good so far, guys. Just uh, keep going with the flow. In some areas, like in the middle, like in the little center here, you want to make like little dark. 
little dark spots. So add some definition and tone to your uh, rifle light right here. Okay, so. Now, we're going to make his second hand. Okay, so this is going to be like fingers. The fingers are going to move like, you know, he's, uh, he's uh, gripping to the rifle and then moving the fingers a little bit. Okay, so this one finger right here is just going to be a little, so a little small finger. And this little big finger, I think it's his middle or his. I think that's his middle finger, but I'm not sure. Hopefully Master Chief doesn't flip us the bird. Okay, so. We're going to go back and add some more detail in it to the... We're going to do the same thing we did with the uh, second hand. Now, I hope you guys can see that, but if you can't, just uh, work with it, you know. Try to make it dark as possible so you guys can actually see it. So right here, instead of making like the little three lines we did on this hand, we're going to make just the little circles. The little shape, I'm going to smudge that in right here if you want to. We finish up on the second on the, uh, the fingers here. Okay, so, not bad, not bad at all. Okay, so, that doesn't look too good, or, you know, it's just, I'm gonna actually bend this one finger out just a little bit so I can see something. Actually, looks like a hand or something, you know. Just spiff up some lines here. Okay. Okay, so we'll make his arm right here and then we're going to end this video after I make put some detailing in this arm okay guys so after this I'm just going to end the video right here after I'm done detailing now you want to make some little round arc kind of like a little gator or something you know there's like little squares of detailing right there. Make sure they are parallel from each other now that they're facing it. Okay, so. Almost done. I'll make this little shape right here. Okay, so I'm, what I'm going to do is just uh, rub it. Ah. 
Rubby rub rub. Rubby scrub scrub. In the bathtub. Sorry. So that's, that is part one, guys. Okay? So, go back. You know, just, uh, uh see why you pause the video and just, uh, you know, study the looks right here. Let's see, my fingers are black as crap. So, I hope this is, uh, very helpful with you guys. If it's not, I'm sorry. I'm going to get better at it, okay? Well, guys, that is it for me. This is David Hooper, the Amazing Artist, signing off once again.